Today on Two Crazy Ketos, we're gonna review the F-bomb nut butters, cheese crisps, and meat sticks. We are gonna drop an F-bomb right, right after, after this. this. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. If you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos, we do product reviews. We talk about various keto topics, and then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for a keto on the couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us on different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com, and that's you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, and that way, every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Today we have a video which is a long time coming. We are going to review the F-bomb line of products. That name. I love the name. Drop an F-bomb.com. Wow. Unforgettable. So we actually got to meet the owners when we were at KetoCon. Ross, Ross and, and Kara. Kara. Ross and Kara. Super nice people. And uh, yeah, we've been meaning to make this and then we eat everything and we never get to the video because we have to repurchase it and then we video. eat those so finally i ordered them and we hid them yes from myself and then i couldn't find them they're just so delicious <laughs> they are they are really good so they have a few different products we're going to review today they have some meat sticks they have some cheese crisps, and then they have nut butters. Which we actually have not tried this flavor, this yep. chili lime flavor. I haven't tried a bunch of the flavors in, in these different items, and they also have a brand new product, which we don't have, which I will be ordering, which is a bone broth. They yeah, have a like powdered, powdered bone broth, where you get it in like 30 servings, and I'm hearing really good things about it. Yeah. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. This is gonna be a little bit different because we're gonna review all the products in one video. That makes me really happy because okay. I'm about to eat all this. If you are interested in these products, there's a link down below in the description and we also have a coupon code, it's 2 crazy ketos. If you use that link, it uh, does help out the channel a little bit. It doesn't cost you anything, but it gives us a little bit of money. But we love these as evidenced by we can't make the video after like five months because I can't keep them in the house. I was gonna say the affiliate uh, stuff will uh, purchase more F-bomb things. Okay, so, um, uh, we're going to start off with, what do you want to start off with? Let's probably the meat because this is going to be like dessert. Yeah. I'm, I was thinking the same thing because if we, if we start with that, like it's going to be nut butter. It's going to be in our mouth and you're not going to taste everything else. So we're, okay. So we're going to do, here's what we're going to do. We're going to try all three different products. We're going to put it through the five things, but we're going to put it all through five things at one time yeah. instead of like each product individually. So these are their meat sticks and these meat sticks are different than most of the other meat sticks. Um, they have three flavors, smokehouse, salt and pepper, and jalapeno. Oh, the jalapeno. What makes these different is they're made with pork. They're 75% fat. So most beef sticks, beef jerky, things like that, Very it's high, in, high protein. in protein. These are high in fat. And uh, this is the jalapeno yes. pork stick. Okay, that's my fave. So, and then we'll get into the prices and stuff when we go over the five things, right? We're playing like um, meat stick roulette. Okay, so this is the meat stick. And we'll break it in half and you can see it is i mean it's just super soft i mean it's really good products fresh fresh I'll lay this guy down because he's not going to stand up on he it he won't stand up soft not chewy and it's got like a great like spice but I don't know. There's like a vinegar element to it. Yeah. That's really tasty. I mean, there's a spice. This so. is jalapeno. These are a little bit spicier. We probably, now I'm thinking we probably should have ended with that one, but that's okay. Cause we're going to go on to the cheese crisp next. I'm very excited about that. Um, those are really good. They're really good. And you know, Joe's the meat stick and bars guy. Okay. Mm -hmm. He loves meat sticks and bars. I do not really go into a lot of your chomps even, or, um, there was a new one that you had just gotten. Oh, the one, the country archer that um, got sent, somebody sent to us. He doesn't have to hide those from me because like those are all him. Chomps have always been my go-to until I tasted these. These he has to hide. I still like chomps, but these are like, these are incredible. One thing, the mouthfeel is like awesome. I think even like Autumn from Watch Autumn Keto would like these ones. Yeah, they're just really good. And again, I love the fact that they're so high in fat and they're poor. 
And but the, the jalapeno has got a nice kick to it. It does. Okay, so um, now there's a bunch of flavors to this. So this is the keto crunch. Keto crunch, and I was gonna look up the flavors that they have on these for you. And they're so like vivid, and they're very very crunchy. If you've had like the Bunker Hill um, cheese crisps. Yeah. These are like super crunchy. Okay, so here's the flavors they have on these. Cheddar cheese, garlic and herbs, salt and vinegar, Ooh. chili lime, oh. buffalo, and then they have a bold variety pack and they have a zesty variety pack. Okay, so I have not had the salt and vinegar and you need to order those. Okay, so this is the chili, chili lime. lime flavor. I kind of want that brown one. You want the brown one? Yeah. I knew you were going to take that. You want that one because it's bigger. No, it just looks like very um, seasoned. We'll just do two. That's what they look like. Okay. Can you hear that? I mean, it is crunchy. Wow. And I like that sour. Oh, there's the chili flavor. Yeah. It's not hot. Mm, oh, no. I like the lime a lot. Yeah. That's why I'm like, you gotta get the salt and vinegar. Cause I like that kind of sour with my savory. Wow, that is good. That They're lime good. really comes through. Those are really good. But I want salt and vinegar. <laughs> that is, up. that's like Bunker Hill quality. Like Bunker Hill's always been my favorite. Oh yeah. And no, those uh, are so good. Especially cause of the flavors, but they got rid of my favorite flavor. So I've been looking for a new one, and I like that flavor. Yeah, you used to like that peri-peri. Yeah. It'll blow your face off. So, okay. So what's in there because... So All the same. <clears throat> the macadamia with coconut. Four flavors. Salted chocolate macadamia. I have never tried that one. Is there one in there of that? Yep. Macadamia with sea salt. Macadamia with coconut. This macadamia with coconut is all of the ones in here. Are you sure we don't have another one? Oh, no, I'm sorry. You're right. And then sea they salt. also have a macadamia pecan with sea salt. I've never tried Ooh. that one. Salted chocolate macadamia. I've Do never those. had this one. You want to try this one? Macadamia with coconuts. What flavor do you want to try? Macadamia with sea salt. I, I definitely want to do the uh, chocolate. The chocolate. So you want to do chocolate? Mm -hmm. Okay. So one thing about these packets, the, I this is what I like about nut butters. Now I've never had this flavor. You've never had this flavor, the nope. salted chocolate. Okay. Um, these nut butters, I like these because this packet's like 200 calories and I know I can get this and I'm not going to overdo it. I can't, I almost cannot have like the big giant pouches or the jars. When it has the big pouch or the jar, it's just like too easy to overdo it. Everything is one serving. So and you know, that's one serving or a jar is one serving. You know, when you rip this open, you've got to finish it. Or even if you're gonna finish half of it now and half with say dinner or no, you, you, but you're not going to like open up another one, especially when you look on the back and see 210. I definitely recommend putting these guys in the freezer. They make the most delicious like-, like brittle. Brittle. Okay, so what I was gonna say though, make sure when you get this, you need them, okay? Anthony- I do need them. Got- I need a lot of them. Anthony had gotten the other flavor, remember? And he just decided, hey, I'm gonna take one of these and open it up and didn't know you're supposed to need them. You need to mix the oil back in with the butter. Think about when you buy fresh peanut butter and it's got all that oil on top and you gotta stir it. That's why the packets are better because you can knead that oil in. Yeah, he's like, they're not very flavorful. It just tastes like oil. And he I was like- He just got the oil. I'm like, that's all you got. Okay, I wish we had a spoon, but oh well. So. I'll let you take the first Ladies suck. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my goodness. Man. That reminds me of the movies. Right? Wow. Like it's just like chocolate and then, but you've got the nuts in there. It's just, wow. Wow. That is really good. I said we just finished this. I know, well, yeah was be being nice. <laughs> and then How good. do I make sure we're getting it even? We'll just have to open up another one. I'll just have to eat that one all together. That is good. It is not overly chocolatey though. No, Like no. I was worried that the chocolate was gonna overpower the oh, macadamia no. nuts. That macadamia nut, they're, they're loading it with macadamia nuts. And you guys know like macadamia nuts are not cheap. <laughs> Unless you live in Hawaii. Good call on ending on that. Good call. Mm -hmm. That was good.
Okay, so you wanna put this through five things? Five things. So five things. So if you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five things. We're gonna talk about the ingredients. We're gonna talk about the nutrition. Does it keto based on nutrition? Uh, how does it taste? How much does it cost? And finally, would we recommend it? Now we have three products, so we're gonna go through these quick. We'll start off in order. So, wow, even with my glasses, I can barely read this. Can I help? I'm looking to see if it's bigger on there. Can you read that? I can totally Can you read, read that? Look at that little tiny print down there on the bottom. Yes, thank you, Lord, I can read it. Pork, water, sea salt, uh, dehydrated jalapeno peppers, encapsulated citric acid, cultured celery powder, uh, ground red pepper, um, let's see, ground mustard, black pepper, granulated garlic, cherry powder, natural liquid smoke, onion powder, in color in a uh, colored beef collagen casing. Wow, those are some good ingredients. Super yeah. clean, no you know, chemicals, no sugar. No sugar. That's a huge thing. Even like curing it, they're maybe they're using the cherry powder or something. But like, well, they're using a celery powder. I mean, it's just it's such great really really good ingredients. Okay, so let's move on to this one. Okay, so the cheese crisps are pasteurized milk, salt, cheese cultures. Then we've got microbial coagulant. Chili peppers, sea salt, dehydrated lime juice, and silicon dioxide, which is going to be a preservative. Oh, I was pulling this one out, but I wanted to make sure because this is like not the same one. So okay. the one that we ate, the salted chocolate macadamia nuts, what's in here is dry roasted macadamia nuts, organic dark chocolate, um, let's see, unsweetened chocolate, cane syrup, cocoa powder, cocoa butter, vanilla and sea salt. Cause basically what they're saying is they're breaking down the, oh, they're dark breaking chocolate. down the chocolate. But if you get the ones that are like macadamia with sea salt, it's just dry roasted macadamia nuts and sea salt. So the chocolate's got some cane syrup, it said. Yeah. So what about the third flavor in there? We have a third mm -hmm. flavor, right? The coconut? Coconuts. The coconut is dry roasted macadamia nuts, raw organic coconut, and sea salt. Okay, good. So if you want to avoid that cane syrup, whatever that is, get uh, don't get the chocolate one. one. So. Okay, that's all the, is that everything? That's yeah. right, that's the ingredients. So number three, oh no, number two, right? We're on number two. Number two, does a keto based on a nutrition label? It's so weird doing three products at once. I know, this is weird for us. Okay, so uh, nutrition label on beef sticks. I can read that. 120 calories per stick, 10 grams of fat, six grams of protein. Which is wild for a beef stick. Really wild. One total carbohydrate. Also wild for a beef stick sometimes. Yeah. So they actually break it down right on the front there, which for you're not gonna see. 75% fat, 20% protein, 3.3% carbs. So Great macros. Okay, and then we have the cheese crisps. Cheese crisps. There's seven crisps in a, pot, in a serving. Which is fair. Two servings in a container, which is pretty good actually. Or one for Rachel. 160 calories per serving, 13 grams of fat, nine grams of protein. Nice. One total carbohydrate, less than one gram of dietary fiber. So one carb. Yeah. And again, another thing, cheese crisps, not normally like higher in fat than protein. No. Usually it's at least equal. And usually, especially when you bring seasoning into it, you can get up in the carbs just from that. So it's right. kind of nice to see such a low, like you get a very flavorful seasoning, but without a bunch of carbs in it. Yeah, I mean, you look at that 160 calories and 120 of them are from fat. So that is a great, great cheese crisp for keto. And then um, on this guy, you've got 210 calories for one of these packets. 22 grams of fat, two grams of protein. Wow. Low. Um, four carbohydrates, three fiber. So you're looking at what? One net carb. One net carb. Now that's the chocolate. I, I bet you the other ones have to be lower. Yeah. So 205 calories on the macadamia with coconut. That's going to have coconut. 21 grams of fat, two grams of protein, five total carbohydrates. Three fibers. Two so net carbs. Two net carbs. Again, coconut. Now, what about just the sea salt? Just the sea salt, 215 calories per serving because they're having to add more of the macadamia nut. Uh, 22 grams of fat, two grams of protein, four carbs, three dietary fiber. One net carb. Now, they so also have, which we did not talk about, you have it over there, 
the MCT, if you were just traveling and need some MCT oil, you want to just squirt some oil in your mouth, yeah. or you don't want to carry a big bottle of it, and they the, have this. And the only thing that's in this is MCT oil. It's 60% of the C8 and 40% C10. It's 250 calories for this like total bomb. And uh, 30 grams of fat, no protein at all, and no carbs. Awesome. Okay, so now we're up to number three. How does it taste? Every single one of these individual products are like top shelf in their realm. So this is the top shelf of meat sticks. This is the awesomest of cheese crisps and the nut butters are crazy good. Yeah, those are crazy really, good. really, really good. I loved, I just like the individual packets. I mean, there's some other nut butters we like, but these are just really, really, really and good. I love their little travel bags too. Yeah, you get little makeup bags. Can you please stop using Ziploc bags and just, we have a bunch of these. Just I know. use these. I know. And then you can walk around with something that says F-bomb on it. Oh my gracious. <laughs> That's probably why I haven't used it yet. Okay, so number four, how much does it cost? Now, there are a lot of different options, so I do have my iPad over here. Um, so that we can kind of go over the different options. And we're gonna start off with the one that I have up already, and that is the nut butters. So you can buy the nut butters a few different ways. They have a four pack sampler. Okay, Where that's you get this guy. one of, nope, that's a, that's a bigger pack. A four pack Variety is one pack. of each one, okay. because they have four flavor. We have a flavor we don't have, okay? That's $12.99. Then they have a 10 count. Okay, and that is $24.99 where you get, you pick a flavor, you get, and it's uh, $24.99 for 10 packs. Oh, okay. Then they have a 16 count variety pack where you, I think that's what this is. All right. It's a 16 count, $35, $34.99. Then they also have a 40 day supply, <laughs> which is 40 packs, and you get some of every flavor, $99.96. Wow. We're getting up there. And then you have a one month supply, which is $74.97. But if you're somebody that's gonna be like, these are great for school lunches, mm -hmm. or you know, you're going on vacation and you just wanna pack for the whole trip and stuff and everybody in your party, like this is great, like if we're going to Disney World and you're taking the two boys with you and everybody's got something to just kinda like put right. in your pocket and go. Yeah. It's nice. So just basically with them, the more you buy, the less you're gonna spend. Which should be that the way that okay. it's done. <laughs> so then we've got the these cheese crisps, twenty seven ninety nine for a six count bag. So for six bags, that's that's they're all the same price. So right, pretty good deal there. They do a subscribe and save twenty five nineteen for subscribe and save. And, and again, we have a coupon got code to get the salt and vinegar. Okay, so finally, we have the pork sticks. Now the pork sticks are, again, we have uh, the three flavors, smokehouse, salt and vinegar, or salt and pepper, or jalapeno. They have a variety pack, which is a 12 count. They're all 12 count, $22.99 for that. So that's uh, a little bit less than $2 a stick, normal price for beef sticks. They're just really filling. Especially good beef sticks. And tasty. Then they also have uh, a 36 count variety pack, where you get 12 of each flavor, and that's $59.99. Okay, so that is all the prices. Overall, the prices are pretty good, right in line with most other competing products. In but the, the ingredients are top shelf, so. Yeah, absolutely, so. So finally, number five, would we recommend this? We would recommend them because we buy these all the time. Yeah, like I did want to discuss, I forgot, let's do the bone broth real quick. So the bone broth, they have a few different flavors. They have savory beef and they have Cajun beef. Oh, ooh. And uh, it's $39.99 for 30 servings, and you can get a variety pack for $79.98 where now you get one of each one. I am assuming that you got some Cajun beef. I have not ordered it yet. I need to order it. Oh, we okay. We need to order that. Cajun beef. Yeah. I would well, I mean, maybe do the variety pack. Try them both, savory and Cajun. So, And it comes again, and it's a powder. You scoop it in, mix it with your water. That's going to be really good for... Um, you know, cooking too. I have a yeah. feeling that you could incorporate it. Yeah. So, so as we were saying, I'm sorry, I just didn't want to forget about that. No. Uh, so yeah, would we recommend it? I would recommend it. Absolutely. So. Well, that is our video for today. Let us know down in the comment section if you've ever tried F-bomb products. Let us know if you've ever dropped an F-bomb. No. Uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> Please do us a favor and hit that like button down below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell icon in that way. Every single time I have to get like my mom face with Joe, You'll be able to. Until next time. Bye. Bye.